assessment questions inside of Schoology that might help you in a jam do formative assessment are the highlight image and the file upload question types. Let's talk about how you create those types and then I'll show you how your student will take them. So first I'm going to, in Schoology, go to Add Materials, Add Assessment, and then I'm going to set up my assessment with the name, the date, and all of that information. I'm going to go ahead and enable submissions here. You can wait to do that later if you need to. And I press Create. When I create the assessment, I'm going to provide some instructions and then um, go through and check on the different settings that will meet the needs of my learner. And then I'm ready to add my questions. So under Questions, I am going to first add a file upload question type. This question type would be very basic. It would just be for students to um, upload a file, maybe something they recorded an IP bill or took a picture of something um, that could go right into this assessment. So for the assessment, I'm just going to say, um, ask a question. It might even be like a word problem of some kind where the students are going to do all their work on paper or IP bill and um, respond. From here, you can talk about how many files they can upload. If it's going to be more, you can add a note. You could add a lear learning objective to show what standard that's aligned to by going into Common Core. Um, and when you're ready, you could even align a rubric if you wanted to add a rubric, and you press Save. Okay, so I have my file upload question. Now I'm going to add my highlight image question. So I'm going to choose that and then I may give some brief directions. I will go to upload image and I'm going to upload a picture that I took of the worksheet that students need to do. And you can't see the whole thing, but if you scroll down, you can. I press OK and then I can select colors that students are allowed to use if I need to. And again, I might align that with learning objectives. Then I press save. Okay, so technically this is ready to go and I have already assigned it to my student. So now let's look to see what it looks like for a student. So students will access the assessment on their iPad and they're gonna open up the Schoology app, navigate to the course, and then they should see that assessment on um, either the side or on um, the bottom here. So I'm just gonna tap on the assessment that I need to take. Okay, choose start attempt. And for my first question, I can read the response. I could answer it on paper. I could do this on IPVO, something of that nature. Um, I could add any kind of file that would be like a JPEG a, um, or a movie file. So if I wanted to do this in um, IPVO and give an explanation, I could upload that explanation or it could be something as simple as a screenshot. So to upload the files, students will go to Upload Files. They're going to choose Photo Library, or they could take the picture right from here. Since um, I answered the question on IPVO as a um, video, I'm going to upload that video, and my video has now been uploaded. So the next thing I'm going to do is go on to the next question. I press Next, and this is my, um, highlight tool and I can see that it wants me to fill in the worksheet so I go to my pen tool here and I'm just going to use my finger to answer the questions um, or I can drag my finger down the side to fill in more but you can see I'm just using my fingers and it's pretty clear to read when I'm finished with that I am going to scroll all the way down to the bottom using the um, on the white side there press review to review my answers, finish, and I'm going to submit. And now it's time for my teacher to assess my work. When you're ready to score your assessments, you are going to go to the assessment either from your materials area or in the upcoming area if it is still there. And um, you will click on grading if it doesn't land on that page. And you'll see the students that need to be graded. So when you open up needs grading, I can view the video um, as a download and watch and assess it and give it its points right here. Um, for your highlight image, you can just skim through 
and add the points. After you have entered each of the scores, you would just go on to the next student if you have another student. Um, otherwise, it will auto record that and it will give you the attempt score at the top. So that's uh, two different question types that you can use for a quick formative assessment that allows students to upload things that they've maybe handwritten or things that they've hand drawn on IPVO and also um, another question type that would allow students to draw right on top of the question.